all ready for action on field 17 at the Los Angeles Galaxy and LAFC to come later on they'll be watching as very interested parties will the fireworks continue Blanco was there wasn't he uh, right place at the right time to sniff it out and uh, create a second opportunity found a OBC with a great pass and an even better strike well, it is showtime at Disney. Jeremy Ibobisi with a wonderful finish. And the Portland Timbers take control. So cleanly struck by Jeremy Ibobisi. It's just beautiful. That is gorgeous. Powerful, definitive finish. Portland regains possession of the ball. They have time and space. They're able to pick out a pass. Good movement of the ball by Ibobisi. And then from then on, the finish was just spectacular. Meanwhile, Darwin Quintero has shrugged off one challenge. Can he pick out the right pass? He can! But Elise cannot find the finish. A rich dividend. There's no need from Bill to Iloma to try to win that ball. You just hold your ground. You just force Darwin Quintero to take a touch back. You've done your job. You gamble. Something on level terms, perhaps. The overall balance of play, but they are not. They continue to strive though for the opening. Manotis! Well, he had the inside step, but Steve Clark, quick thinking and quick acting to get out there. And in hearing the communication on the field, it was interesting. It's Williamson who's found a lot of space. Valeri! Diego Valeri! Consummate strike for the Argentine. Through the first half. And during the course of the game, that area between the back line of Houston and the midfield of Houston, where Matias Vera has to cover so much space. Well, Chris Tuval is another who's experienced uh, both sides of the coin here tonight. Although he only played one time for the Dynamo. That's Elise rising really well. Or what Diego Valori is doing down the right hand side. Now there's a VAR review taking play and uh, taking place. Was there a handball as Elise went up for that header in the last Houston attack? Man, it, it's tough to say whether there is contact with the ball. But the arm was definitely flailing, wasn't it? Yes, it was. And the penalty is given. It's Elise against Clark. And a supremely confident take from Albert Elise. Enough power behind this strike by Albert Elise that Steve Clark doesn't really get a good push off. By the time he reacts, no chance he's getting there. 2 1. Well, there's been a couple of switches for the Dynamo as well. They now chase it. Victor Cabrera has come on, I believe. Uh, Tommy McNamara is also on the field for the Dynamo. Elise judged to have been the aggressor. Well, it takes a lot to fell Dewey Loma. In fact, it took a red card offence from Albert Elise to do it. I mean, yes, there is contact with the face of Tui Loma, but I have to tell you, there's no chance that Albert Elise is swinging his arm. We've had the six minutes. This really is it for the Dynamo. The flick on arriving. And that is that. The Portland Timbers make it two wins out of two.